Go along with them for now? That doesn't sound good. We have a process. Our own way of doing things. Your guys better not have a problem with that. Things don't go well for troublemakers here. I hope that's clear. No problem. We won't have to worry about them. Didn't sound that way. They just need time to get used to things. I hope you're right. Come on. Yeah, but a lot of things has happened, though, because of these guys. Like, a lot of things. Where are we going? Kate asked for you. I thought you'd want to check on her. That sounds super sketchy. Listen, Javi, Gabe... He told me some pretty messed up things. Ooh. Things I need your help wrapping my head around. He shouldn't have done that. I wanted to tell you myself. Bad news is bad news. Who cares who delivers it? He told me you lost Mariana. Was it my fault? Just a few days ago. Oh. I'm sorry, David. She's... She's gone. Can I explain? Like, dude, it was your people. It's strange grieving for the same person twice. Like losing something you didn't know you had. What was she like, Javi? She was so little when we got separated. Who did my little girl become? She kept us. She really we did kept us well. going. Her smile kept me going through a lot of rough times. That must have been nice. How? How did she die? Your people. Tell me how it happened. Please, I need to know. She was just standing there, minding her own business. She just found her lost headphones in the dirt. She was smiling. And then someone put a bullet in her head. What kind of animal would just open fire on her your like that? Your people. An animal with your mark. My people aren't in the habit of killing little girls. David, I was there. They shot Kate, too. Ask your buddy at the gate if you don't believe me. Max was a part of this? Fuck. Yeah. I need details. What the hell went down out there? I need to know exactly what happened. I was kidnapped. Bastards knocked me out and threw me in their truck. I got away yeah. near this town, Prescott. The same assholes attacked us there. Their leader flooded it with walkers and, and tear gas. Leader? A crazy bald guy with yeah. a beard. Badger, what the fuck have you done now? A lot of shit, man. I'm gonna handle a this. A lot of shit. Bitch, okay? Do me a favor. Keep this to yourself. The politics here, they can get messy. I thought you were the boss. There's four of us that run, Richmond. You need to impress the other three. Or you'll be back on the road by morning. What am I supposed to do to impress the other three people? Try not to stir things up. Mm. You and your friends could have a very short I'll follow stay. your lead. I can be impressive when I try. I'll follow your lead. Just don't get cute. I run security here. But it's not like my word is law. This shit with Badger doesn't make things any easier. Oh, God. It's... Who's the fresh meat? Ava. This is my brother, Javi. The baseball brother? <laughs> no shit. What are the chances of you turning up on the doorstep? Welcome to civilization. It's a pleasure to meet you, Ava. Oh, is it now? You didn't say he was a gentleman, David. That's because he's not. Ava's my right hand. If there's anyone you can trust in Richmond, it's her. Hmm. I don't know about that. That woman, a fucking soldier. She was the first person I met up with after you and me got separated. I never would have made it without her. She's also the one that technically recruited Clementine, Gabe right? Gabe said you went back to the house. Yeah. At the start. Yeah. I'm sorry I never found you. It doesn't yeah, matter now. We found each other now. We found each other in the end. It matters to me. 
Mama and I got routed out of the city on the way to the hospital. It wasn't long before she turned. Poor Mama. I couldn't get back into Baltimore, so I hooked up with my old unit. We thought we could build a safe zone outside D.C. After what happened to Mama and everyone else, I thought you were all dead. I mean... But you were taking care of them. Yeah. Weren't you? Somehow you found a way. I'm not gonna lie. I never thought you had it in you. We took care of each other. And we all had each other's backs. You've changed, brother. It took the end of the world. But you finally grew up. <sighs> yeah, we'll go with that one. This is where they're treating Kate. Don't get comfortable. We're not staying long. Hmm. I don't know about this. Is it bad that I'm really skeptical? I'm really skeptical. Hey! Hey, kid. Got everything you need? Uh, yeah. This place is like a resort. Check it out, Javi. Noodles in a cup. We need to get you some real food. Stat, turn you into a soldier. <laughs> Javi, I'm glad you're okay. <laughs> I'm a lot better seeing you. Damn, it's good to have you back. Look at this family. Look at my wife. Isn't she the most beautiful woman alive? Come on. With the lights off, you could mistake me for a walker. A damn fine walker. You're a lucky man, David. We're all lucky. Yeah, I'm bullshitting through my teeth right now. Uh, what, you okay? Uh, my... oh, shit. I'll get the doc. I'm fine. I just needed to talk to you, alone. What's up? I'm scared, Javi. More than I was the whole time on the road. Even when I thought I was going to die, everything inside me screams to get away from here. These people are killers. And David? David threw his own brother in a cell. Yeah, I know what you mean. Yeah. This place gives me the creeps. <sighs> I'm glad to hear that. I was afraid you'd been won over by the security here. It's always been you and me on the road, Javi. That's how we've made it this far. Please, promise me we'll go back to that. The first chance we get. Yeah, I'm pretty sure though that the brother's gonna come looking for us. We can't let ourselves get locked in. I hear you, Kate, but we can't just turn our backs on this place. On my brother. Javi. We have to try to make it work. I used to say that about my fucked up marriage. Guess it still applies. Whatever. Just please. Please don't leave me alone for too long. Feeling better? How you doing, sweetheart? David reported some pain. It's less now. Strange how it just comes and goes. Doesn't seem normal. I think she pulled her stitches when she sat up. Her stitches? I doubt it. But pain often comes in waves with abdominal wounds. <laughs> I'll give you something to take the edge off, in case it comes back. Truly really superlative work. I thought I'd have to operate, but all she needed was IV fluids and some antibiotics. How did you find someone with skills like these? A wound like this kills nine out of ten. Whoever did this really knows their stuff. That would be Eleanor. One of my friends you threw in quarantine. Well, she's no use to anyone there. We should let her out. I'll vouch for her. Wow. Agreed. I'll have Ava bring her here. I want to meet this Eleanor. I'm sure she'll be an asset to our community. You can't just cherry pick who you want. Why don't you let them all out? Can they all perform surgery on a dirt floor with a pair of pliers and no anesthetic? Uh... That is your answer. Javi and I have to go meet some people now. See if we can't prove he's worth a damn. We're gonna take real good care of you. Okay? Uh, I still don't know about this. Send my apologies, David. 
I won't be able to make it. Feeling okay? Fine. I just want to keep an eye on my patient. The others know my vote is with you. Come on. The others? Is he the other one? Remember what I said. When we meet these guys, keep what happened to Mariana to yourself. Badger is one of my guys. And I will handle him. Hmm. I still don't know how I feel about this. Is it bad that I'm skeptical about my own brother? I, mean, I guess it kind of is, but... Ah, oh, it's super confusing. I don't know. Hmm. Guess we'll have to find out. Oh god. This place is weird. It may look pretty, but it's all sugars. There's no substance. It tastes pretty, Clint. That's all that matters. Ah, the brother. Avi, meet the guys. What? Clint runs food production. The crops you saw, that's him and his people. Jones, our bridge to the outside world. She handles contact with other settlements. Pleased to meet you, Javi. I trust you've been treated well. I hope you haven't been handled too roughly. Some of our people left their courtesy with their old lives. <laughs> oh yeah, the cell you threw me in was totally five star. I'm sorry about that. <laughs> we have to be careful. I'm sure you can understand. <laughs> we were just about to eat. Clint was trying to convince me of the essential superiority of his cream spinach over my magnificent Black Forest Gateau. It's no contest. The spinach has real nutritional value. Javi, take a look at that table. You tell me what you'd rather put in your belly. Spinach from Clint's garden? <laughs> or a baked delicacy by you? I mean, oh, it's pretty good. Everything looks so good, I, I want it all. So polite, David. You sure he's your brother? Can't trust a diplomat. Always saying one thing and thinking another. Please, make yourself comfortable. I have no idea what to say here. Oh my god, what the hell? We value straight talk here, so please, forgive me if I seem direct. We're usually pretty strict about who we open our doors to. Your brother's word counts for a lot. Is that so? The three of us and Dr. Lingard make all the decisions here, so yeah. People who choose to stay with us, they have to deal with us bossing them around. Not saying you wouldn't, but it can be an adjustment. Especially for the more independent-minded. There's no structure out there now. People get used to doing as they please. I always do what I'm told. Ask my older brother. You're gonna <laughs> I can see that already. When Joan and I met your brother, he was trying his hand at fruit. Fruit? We found him slowly murdering an orchard on the Shenandoah River. Hotty fucking huh? I helped him bring it back to life. We had a good run there. For as long as it lasted. What happened? What always happens. We trusted the wrong damn people. That's what led us to start this. Wondering what this fine piece of body art is all about? It's our litmus test for loyalty. I've seen that mark a few times. You probably saw it at the gates. Right, Javi? We all took it as a sign of commitment. It was a crude answer to a difficult problem. I mean, I have it seen the mark before. Worked. Please understand. I kinda can't. We had a terrible winter just after we moved here. We... we lost a great deal. Loved ones who left holes in our lives. Protecting my people from that kind of pain, that's what keeps me awake at night. It turned me into a perpetual night owl. I know it's a lot to ask. I, 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 I know how they feel, feel, kind of, so... Seeing the people I care about suffer, it, it's a terrible feeling. I just want to shield them from it all. It's a noble aim. One worth fighting for. Yeah. Oh no. Max? What are you doing here? I sent for him. Since when does he answer to you? From what I hear, he's well acquainted with your brother. They exchanged a few bullets outside our walls. Is that right? Is there bad blood between you and Max? Nothing that can't be worked out. I want to hear that from Javi. Let's just say I wouldn't invite him to my wedding. Yeah, I wouldn't fucking go. Good. 
because I just said you wouldn't be invited. Max, how did this start? Don't look at him. You have an obligation to tell the truth. We caught him siphoning gas from one of our vehicles. Max. Sorry, David. I know he's family, but your brother's a thief. Is it true? It's not! Answer her. I was scavenging whatever I could find. I had no idea it belonged to you. You just asked. We'd have given it to you. He wasn't there! That... that's not all. Rufus said Clementine ran his truck off the road just to break him free. Clementine? Girl we had trouble with in the past. You can always judge a man by the company he keeps. Running with that girl don't look good. I would say not. Let's judge you then. You got some colorful friends. So what if Hobby met up with Clementine? It doesn't mean anything. We kicked her out for a reason, David. Now the two of them are thick as thieves. This is who you're asking us to vouch for, David? Seriously? You know we can't just open our doors to bandits. We're trying to build something different here. Everything I did out there was to protect my people. That's more than I can say for you. I'm not sure what you mean. Javi? You have something to say? One of your people, some asshole called Badger, he put a bullet in a little girl, my niece, David's daughter. What? Damn it, Javi, I told you I'd handle it. No, David, this cousin fucking dirtbag has the balls to accuse me. He and Badger destroyed an entire town. That's enough. No, we need to hear this. Go on, Javi. Sounds like you've got more to get off your chest. They overran Prescott with walkers, ran them in on trucks. Badger did that. Not me! You were right there next to him. I tried to get him to stop, I swear! David, we warned you about getting your soldiers in line. We don't know all the facts. We know enough. She's right, David. You've lost control. I want them gone. All of them. Take Javi and everyone in the quarantine to the gate. Send them out with enough weapons to defend themselves, but no more. Look, we can't fight this. Not now. Kate and Gabe will be safe here. Your doctor friend, too. But the rest of you, you're gonna have to do what they say. I'm sorry. This is ridiculous. You have to do something. I... I can't right now. But maybe I can down the road. Just stay alive. Okay? I think either way that would have gone, I would have been kicked out. I don't know. I do. I think either way that would have gone, I would have been kicked out. So I just checked the ending, I guess. 